Not all of Lincoln's current SUV lineup gets me that excited, but that could really change with this Aviator. It's a three-row luxury SUV with this fabulous design, rear-wheel drive, and a twin-turbocharged plug-in hybrid powertrain. First of all, just look at it. This is a really sleek SUV, certainly sleeker and more svelte looking than the Navigator. The way that all the bodywork just sort of drapes over the big SUV bones and the way the roofline folds down at the back. I love this paint, the chrome trim and the big wheels. It's a really stunning look for this SUV. And of course, the inside is gonna be extremely luxurious too. Not only is there a lot of space for all three rows of seats, but you've got lovely leather, wood, and metal trim throughout the cabin, as well as cool features like, just on the Continental, 30-way power adjustable front seats that massage, so you'll always be able to get yourself nice and comfortable. Now, Lincoln hasn't shared a whole lot of technical details so far, but we do know this is gonna have a plug-in hybrid powertrain with a bi-turbocharged engine. Now, that probably means it's gonna be a version of the bi-turbo EcoBoost V6 that you can find in the Navigator and some other Ford products. And having plug-in hybrid technology should improve both acceleration and fuel economy compared to what you might expect for a luxury SUV of this size. The Aviator also goes high-tech to keep its occupants really comfortable. There's a forward-facing camera that watches the road surface and proactively adjusts the suspension so that you'll be as comfortable as possible over bumps. That's technology that until now we generally only saw in much more expensive European luxury cars. For now, the Lincoln Aviator is just a preview, but we're told that the finished production version is gonna look very similar when it's on the road next year. And I think it's a really exciting look at where Lincoln's luxury SUVs are gonna go in the future.